evening, good 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 evening. How y'all doing this evening? Come on. Yes, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Father God. Yes, Lord. Now, those who come know how I like to do about this here time. You come out and pray for this kingdom family of mine. You come out. Yes, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Father. We come to you humble before your throne. We sit at your feet in meditation, looking up at you in awe, Lord Jesus. We give you all the glory. We replace your crown of thorns with a crown of glory. Crown this jewel with us, your children, encrusted, circling around you, Lord Jesus, praying and praising your holy name. We plead your precious blood over us and all that concerns us, Lord Jesus. Keep us protected and preserved from all evil, Father. In your mighty name, amen. Ooh, yes. Lord. Now, I, I know you see the title. I'm talking about. The title says, Those who gossip to you will gossip about you. I'm talking about. That's them snakes in the grass. I'm talking about. That's that Leviathan that don't want to let you go. I'm talking about. But the sword of heaven, you talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. He swings that sword down. He chops off the heads of those snakes, you talking about? Yes, Lord. Listen. Now, the title kind of goes with what I have been saying last couple of weeks about, you know, the signifying monkey, you talking about? That's that joint that will cause dysfunction between others. You know what I'm And sit back and watch. You know what I'm Sit back and watch and see who, you know, see what happened. You know what I'm And then they'll act like, you know, they the ones that solve the problems. You know what I'm You know, when people gossip and don't have facts, you know what I'm talking about? That can lead to a lot of warfare, not only for the person that they targeting, but for themselves. You talking about? Because when those things that they do, those accusations, those incorrect uh, statements, when those things don't come true and manifest like they said that they would, you know, that's when they come in and try to sabotage, to try to cover up. You know what I'm talking about? The things that they have already done. That's that throwing them rocks and hiding their hands. You know what I'm talking about? Because they be mad and they be frustrated. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. That, you know, God helped us make it. You know, all those people are, I'm going to say are conglomerates. All of us who have been through this thing, because, you know, I like to talk about myself. You know what I'm talking about? Because he is using me as an example, just like he uses my baby. You know what I'm talking about? As an example, a sample of his glory. You know what I'm talking about? You see, when these people go around making up these stories with half truths, you know what I'm talking about? When they expose themselves, because it's not us, everybody sees their action. And the reaction from what they, you know, started. You talking about? You know, some people feel like <clears throat> they can't get no light if everybody's looking at you. But they just seem like they don't have a clue. They're looking at you because of what they do. You talking about? And that's that gossip. That's them lies. That's that slander. You know what I'm talking about? So now, as they do those things, 
like I like to say, you know what I'm talking about? I tell my baby this all the time, too, you know what I'm talking about? Because she, you know, she has good wisdom and she, she schools me, too, you know what I'm talking about? I listen to my wife. I love you, baby. You know what I'm talking about? Listen. You know, that's free promotion, you know what I'm talking about? Because if you live it upright, you know what I'm talking about? And you have a clean heart and your hands are clean, you know what I'm talking about? Nothing but the light of the Lord will gleam. You know what I'm talking about? To have you glowing. You know what I'm talking about? Now listen. You know, when those things don't come to pass, that's why these joints have resulted to going to get these practitioners, these voodoo doctors, these people that are of evil. I had someone try to tell me, oh no, voodoo is a religion. It probably is. I don't know because I don't mess with that. You know what I'm talking about? And it ain't evil and this and that. Well, how come these people are using it to do evil things? You know what I'm talking about? You know, like have someone do something against their will. Have someone to get killed. Have someone to have accidents. Have someone to lose income. Have someone to lose jobs. Have someone to, you know, kill themselves. You know what I'm talking about? Forgive me, Lord Jesus, and you too. Unalive, I guess that's the term that they want to use, themselves. You know what I'm talking about? You know, we keep it a buck over here. This is authentic or nothing. You know what I'm talking about? And we do not wrestle. With the flesh. Come on. We are blessed by the best. Come on. Tag, Father, you in. You come on. You win. You come on. Yes, Lord Jesus. And you know, these people make up these stories and these false rumors just to say that they were attached to whatever's going on in a person that they target his life. You come on. And they might even be, you know what I'm talking about? Until, you know, like me and my baby say, we come to a realization, the revelations of these type of people that have been attached to us that don't mean us no more good, you know what I'm talking about? And that's when they really start to attack and show their true colors of who they are, you know what I'm talking about? That's when they'll ramp it up with their witchcraft. They'll ramp it up with their spells. They'll ramp it up with their gossip, with their lies, with their slander, trying to make the, what they are doing stick to you. But God is our glue. You know what I'm talking about? He holds things together for us. You know what I'm talking about? Because he's the one who really knows us. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. He knew us before the womb. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. So when these people do these things, I'm talking about when they come to you with this gossip, with this slander, you talking about, and they make it seem like it's a serious thing, you know what I'm talking about? They try to backpedal after they get caught red-handed, you know what I'm talking about, and act like, oh, it was a joke, God just playing, you know you my girl, you know you my boy, you know what I'm talking about? They do those things just so that they can see where your heartstrings are. Because when they know that you follow God faithfully and you are his child, that you have a good heart. You come out. So they'll play on that heartstring. And these joints be knowing these things like the back of their hand. So they'll go into those scriptures where they'll be saying, you know, you have to forgive me and, you know, you got to love your enemy and all that. No, we don't. That's God's job because we pray for them. You talking about? And as we pray for them, we release them. You talking about? These people don't want to be released because they feel like they can't go to the feast that God has prepared for you on your table. They got a table. They food getting cold, but they're too busy looking at yours. And they're gathering up people in behind the scenes you know, who also do these type of things, but they pretend, you know what I'm talking about? You know, they pretend that they holier than thou, that they don't get out like that, but then turn around and join in with the crowd, you know what I'm talking about? And I, like I told my nephews, you know what I'm talking about? And I tell my kids this too, you know what I'm talking about? 
you know, if you see a crowd of people over here hanging at the edge of the cliff and one on jump, say, oh, it's fine to jump. You can come up. And them joints start all jumping you tomorrow. You ain't gonna go over to the edge and see them all jacked up. You know what I'm talking about? Don't never follow the crowd. You know what I'm talking about? God made us how he made us. You know what I'm talking about? When you follow a crowd, they will lead you astray because you're not going in your way. You know what I'm talking about? And people will get mad at you for that. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, my auntie, I just visited the other day. It made sense to me. You know what I'm talking about? And it made sense to me because she was talking about Crocs. You know what I'm talking about? She said she got a, a, a group of people that she play cards with. And one of them asked her about, you know, wearing crops. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, you like these? She said, no, nah, I don't too much care for them. You know what I'm talking about? Well, everybody do them. You know what I'm talking about? Well, I ain't everybody. You know what I'm talking about? I'm me. You know what I'm talking about? And I'm going to be me because that's how God made me. You know what I'm talking about? That's how God made you. You know what I'm talking about? That's that, that. When she said that, that brought me back to the thought that I have. Way back in the day, when the craze, and I, I love Michael Jordan. You talking about? I love watching him fly. Ooh, you talking about? Yes, Lord. But when his shoes really took off and started becoming popular, you talking about? Everybody in the neighborhood had to have them shoes. You talking about? So they feel like they can fly. Ooh, you talking about? But half them joints couldn't even jump. Couldn't even shoot a jumper. You talking about? They just wanted it for a fashion statement. I got this. This is uh, my status. You know what I'm talking about? <clears throat> and as I saw that, you know what I'm talking about? I was just like, you know, I'd rather have some Reeboks, some Adidas. You know what I'm talking about? Because I don't want to look like everybody else. You know what I'm talking about? That's why I believe he gave me this ministry, Authentic or Nothing, so that I do not conform to this world. You know what I'm talking about? And he's bringing a lot of his children in that same manner to not conform to this world because all that gossip is conforming to the world. You know what I'm talking about? He wants you to conform to him. You know what I'm talking about? He wants you to come to him. You have questions, you have thoughts about different things, talk to him. Have a relationship with him. You know talking about when it comes to serious matters of the heart. You know talking about? Because see, when these type of people realize that you have serious matters of the heart, that's when they start the little karmic spark. You know talking about? That's when they're, they, oh, they, you know, you got this going on, you got this going on. You know talking about? And I can't, you know, do anything to like you know get a piece of this you talking about you know they had a term about those type of people and their addictive habits and patterns you talking about and it, it sprung up from the 80s where you know drugs really went rampant you talking about and there were a lot of crack babies babies addicted to crack because the mother was smoking the father was smoking you talking about and now the child had to be subjected to that. You talking about? So the child come into the world nervous and you know just ungodly like you talking about. And they have an addictive pattern to them, to where you know they don't know where it's at. And I'm of uh, I don't ever want to call myself a victim, but I am a part of that as well. You talking about, and so I understand. You talking about for those who know that that's part of their issue. You talking about that's a generational curse that was placed upon us, especially in poor communities. You talking about, and you know when that term came out, you know people thought it was funny. You talking about. I ain't even gonna hold you up. I even laughed at it. You know what I'm talking about? 
But as I think about it, as I mature, as I got older, you know what I'm talking about? I'm like, you know, I didn't really like doing that. I ain't like selling crack because I seen what it was doing to the people in my community. You know what I'm talking about? So, yeah, I still was doing what I was doing. You know what I'm talking about? I sold a little weed. Man, a lot of weed, but you know what I'm talking about? But that's not the point that I'm getting to. The point that I'm getting to is you never know what the next person is going through. You know what I'm talking about? And when you add in someone in the background that sees something going down and those pers those people want to persecute you because they jealous of you, they hate you, they want to be you, they want to take your place. So then, you know, that's when they do those things. Spread lies, spread gossip, spread rumors. They'll even come to you with some mess just to see if you gonna run and go and you know make it even bigger than what they made it. You know what I'm talking about? Without having no facts, without having no discernment, without having no common sense. You know what I'm talking about? Because they want you to conform to the world. You know what I'm talking about? That's what the devil wants you to do. You know what I'm talking about? To conform to the toxicity of those type things and activities. You know what I'm talking about? People look at it all day long on TV, on YouTube, in the newspapers. You know what I'm talking about? Go outside. You see somebody out there fighting. You know what I'm talking about? Now you on the phone. Yeah, so and so fighting. So, you know what I'm saying? This and that and third. Now, that person that you're talking to, on the other end of the phone, yeah, they said they did this and that and third, make it bigger than what it was. You talking about? You know, when you can just be like, you know, either mind your business or find a solution to stop that situation from going on. You know what I'm talking about? You know, it was a about. A week or so ago, I was doing a live, minding my business. You talking about? That's how he usually hits me. You talking about? And I heard somebody scream. I heard a man scream. You talking about? And I heard a woman voice. You talking about? She was getting down on whoever it was. You talking about? And I was just like, you know, Lord. So then, it it got all lit up with lights and sirens and everything. You know what I'm talking about? So I'm like, man, you know. What what am I to do about that? That's why I didn't even mention it. I just said I'm gonna go check it out. You talking about and see what it's about because it was in front by my house. You talking about and I, I look outside. You talking about the house could be on fire and anything. You talking about so you know I didn't say anything about it because that's not God's will. It wasn't His will for me to even speak on that. About, but I'm making an example of things that's, that has went on around me. You talking about? It ain't none of my business, no my concern. Because I don't even know them joints. You talking about? But it's people, if those people were famous, it's people, you know, and we don't claim fame. We give all the glory to God. You know what I'm talking about? These people be thirsty for fame. And if they see something going on, in the life of a person who's well liked, who's well uh, blessed, you know what I'm talking about? If they see some things going on with them, you know what I'm talking about? Seeing them being attacked, they join in on that attack, you know what I'm talking about? Just to make themselves seem important, you know what I'm talking about? And they'll have other people that, you know, they didn't got fooled into believing that, oh yeah, you know what you're talking about, because you know, and they dig into you, they hack your phone, they hack your email, they they watch you all day long. You know what I'm talking about? Just to see the scoop, so they can run back and go and tell the group. You know what I'm talking about? They won't come to you direct and say, "Hey, let's resurrect this. Let's try to help you out. Let's get you out this situation so that you, you know, continue shining." You know what I'm talking about? As you grinding. Because we still be going hard with all these things in the background bombarding us. You know what I'm talking about? 
just a little bit that we say out of our mouths when we talk to you. You know what I'm talking about? That's just a little bit. You don't see the rest of it behind the scenes. You know what I'm talking about? You know, because we give those things to the Lord. We pray profusely for real. We do this. This is not a fashion statement. You know what I'm talking about? This is a way of life. You know what I'm talking about? And these people disguise it. You know what I'm talking about? When they speak out the name of Christ and then turn around and, oh, yeah, well, well what so-and-so said? Well, what you had to say about that? You know what I'm talking about? Well, I ain't had nothing to say about that. Why? Because I gave it to God and I kept on moving on. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. And that's the same thing that he wants us to do, to keep on keeping on. You know what I'm talking about? Let him resolve the issues and the problems. Without getting a bunch of people that got their two cents and want to add it to it. You know what I'm talking about? Because God don't add no two cents. He's the Alpha and the Omega. You know what I'm talking about? And he gives us the discernment to walk away. These people don't want you to walk away because you making them a payday. You know what I'm talking about? Because every five seconds... Somebody want to see something toxic, something karmic. They don't realize that they are rotting in their brain and binding their soul to toxicity. You know what I'm talking about? They don't realize that. You know what I'm talking about? That's when, you know, his children come and like I'm doing right now, you know what I'm talking about? And my baby does all the time. You know what I'm talking about? We let you know this. You know what I'm talking about? It's up to you to receive these messages. You know what I'm talking about? That's coming through to help you elevate and grow and, you know, become more closer to God and become more pure in heart. You know what I'm talking about? To where you don't even want to be bothered. You know what I'm talking about? With no toxicity. You know what I'm talking about? You don't want nothing. Listen, I was up and arguing with no joints. I move myself around. You know what I'm talking about? That, you know, boo. You know what I'm talking about? The joint, I ain't never been kicked out of nowhere. You know what I'm talking about? Nowhere. You know what I'm talking about? But those type of joints, you know, they get you kicked out of somewhere because, you know, they love living in that toxicity. You know what I'm talking about? They love living in drama. You know what I'm talking about? The whole thing that they got going on is based in that drama that you are delivering or being delivered by God and being detached from. They want to keep it going because they feel like that's what got them growing. You know what I'm talking about? When in all reality, it is nothing but the devil using them. And God uses evil for good. And they get mad and upset. And they punishing themselves because they promoting us. You know what I'm talking about? How you mad and upset? And you the one promoting us because they didn't expect that God's light and his precious blood would speak for us. You know what I'm talking about? They didn't feel like, you know, oh no, I, I think I'm right. You know what I'm talking about? No, that can't be right. You know, why is he doing this? Why is she doing this? How is they doing this? And when we say God, you know what I'm talking about? They, oh, that's facade. You know what I'm talking about? No, they, they can't be. You know what I'm talking about? Because I'm holier than thou. I pray all day too. You know what I'm talking about? And I don't do this and I don't do that. And I don't got what's going on in their life. I'm talking about going on in mine. But they have something. They hide their skeletons in the closet. They don't want to talk about them. They'd rather talk about someone else. You know what I'm talking about? And make them a target. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Not by your own works. God's goodness. Yes, Lord Jesus. The precious blood of Jesus is over us. You know what I'm talking about? We are protected and preserved. So all those evil arrows, which, you know, they don't think is evil arrows, but they are. You know what I'm talking about? When you do such things like that, when you, uh, you know that it's not true, but you just know that this person glow and you want to keep on keeping them up in a conversation that's negative. You know what I'm talking about? Even if they try to pretend that it's a good situation, 
that's that's the the other tactic. You know what I'm talking about? Because you know when they figure out that the other route ain't working, you know, just like the devil, he's a karmic joint. You know what I'm talking about? He wants to keep on. Well, I'm going the wrong way. He wants to go this way. You know what I'm talking about? He wants to keep pulling you back and reeling you in until he catch you and he gets you into sin. You know what I'm talking about? And sin could be, you know, you arguing with this joint about this ain't right. You, you're lying. You know what I'm talking about? Now, what you doing? You engaging with them. That's what they want. They want you to engage with them because they're toxic. And now, as you engage with them, the next thing they going to do is say, oh, look, I told y'all. Because then they sat up there and talked about you like a dog and said that you mean, that you, you know what I'm saying, that you're evil, that you do this and you do that. You know what I'm talking about? When you be minding your business, but you just said stop. You told that person to stop. You know what I'm talking about? No, they can't let you go because, you know, God is making you a pro. He's making you glow. And he is using them. As the footstools to help you grow. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. This is authentic or nothing. And I, I was just like, you know, a joint want to play both sides of the fence. They want to smile in your face and smile in the face of a person that's doing this to you. You know what I'm talking about? They got to go too. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, this walk is a lonely road, but, you know, he always takes care of us. Come on. And he's going to put the right people in the place of the wrong people. You know what I'm talking about? Because he brings up strong people. You know what I'm talking about? We draw our strength from the Lord. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. You know, because as surely as they gather, they'll be scattered. And how they get scattered when they get caught red handed? You know what I'm talking about? It's, like I said, this particular joints, come out, they be doing what they doing, trying to ruin reputations. You know what I'm talking about? Because they want to be up in that next person's spot. You know what I'm talking about? I want to be in my spot. I want to be in my baby spot. And I'm like, man, you don't, you, you really want this? You know what I'm talking about? Do you really? You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. I wouldn't wish this on nobody. You know what I'm talking about? But I'm happy for what God gives me. You know what I'm talking about? That's what being gracious, that's what being pure at heart is. You know what I'm talking about? Ooh, yes, Lord Jesus. Come on in, Holy Spirit. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. You know, this is authentic or nothing. And I can't make none of this here joining up. You know what I'm talking about? We're going to get some script in. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord. What you want me to say? What you want me to say? What you want me to say? What you want me to tell our people? Your children. You talking about? I pray that what I said today helps somebody change their ways. You talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. Because you know, simply saying "grow up," that people take offense to that. You know, talking about Lord Jesus. They take offense to saying, "Hey, grow up." You know, get a life. You talking about move on? They take offense to that. You know, talking about Lord Jesus. Keep us protected and preserved. Because we heard you, Lord Jesus. And we hear you, Lord Jesus. And we always want to be near you, Lord Jesus. We thank you for your God and your mighty leadership, Lord Jesus. We give you all the glory. Woo Lord Jesus. Give us a good one like you always do. Let this help me. Let it help someone else, too. Where you got us at? Wait, where he at? He got us in Mark. Mark 10. And Mark 12. In Mark 10, he got us right on 27. And in Mark 12, he got us right on 4. But those who come here already know. We gonna run them joints. You talking about till we get some straightening around this joint, Jack. You talking about? And that's a fact. It says, Jesus looked at him and said, With man it is impossible, 
but not with God. For all things are possible with God. Let me come on. All things are possible. These joints can change their ways. It's some that refuse it. You know, people are gonna lose it. I'm talking about like like what I had to say earlier about, you know, he speaks in parables. I'm talking about now everybody start thinking that it's cute to speak in tongues. You're talking about. And I understand, you know, sometimes we get to a loss of words because we be trying to forgive me, Lord, for cussing. We be pushing the message out that's flowing through us. You come out. And, you know, some people, they use it as a cover up to see what you're talking about. So, in the back of their mind, they could pray against it. You know what I'm talking about? There go behind the scenes after seeing, you know, the good things that you asked for the Lord to bring into your life and do witchcraft over it. Pray against it. You know what I'm talking about? And I'm not saying that all joints do this. You know what I'm talking about? I'm just saying that you know the ones that do it. You can see it in the spirit if you have eyes to see it. If you have ears to hear it. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, they be running their mouth with that slick talk. You know what I'm talking about? Because they feel like that you are weaker, that you are beneath them. You know what I'm talking about? And how they feel like that? Because they run around, be boasting. I'm a man of God. I'm a woman of God. I'm a this and I'm a that. You know what I'm talking about? I'm a child. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. My baby, she's a child. You a child. You know what I'm talking about? These joints want to step upside, they, outside they britches. You know what I'm talking about? For fame and riches. You're talking about they don't want to work. They want to live off his word. Literally. You're talking about not the instruction, but by the corruption that they, you're talking about, then devised. You're talking about. And they mixing it with the Roman situation. You're talking about. Well, remember when God said, okay, you get this joint his and you give me mine. Did you see him walking around? With a pan, talking about some, oh, give me some chillings and I'll heal you. No. You know what I'm talking about? But why is we paying doctors for? You know what I'm talking about? Yes, we need this money so that we can grow. But even Jesus was a carpenter. He had a job. You know what I'm talking about? A lot of them joints, they ain't got no job. They didn't mess around and took these people money, then tricked them out their money, and now they, you know, well, well, you know, I got their money now, you know, they didn't devise plan. I'm gonna invest in this business and now, you know, they getting uh that money, you know, washing it, like money laundering. You know what I'm talking about? Pretty much. You come know up, Rico act, all that giant. You know what I'm talking about? Because they're not just doing it by themselves. It's a group of these giants that's doing it. And y'all know. What I'm talking about, you talking about, yes, Lord, says, Peter began to say to him, lo, we have left everything to follow you. Jesus said, truly, I say to you, there is no one else who is left in the house or brother or sister or mother, or father, or children, or lands for my sake and for the gospel, who will not receive a hundredfold now in this time, houses and brothers and sisters and mothers and children and land with persecutions, and in the age to come, eternal life. But many that are first will be last. And last will be first. You know, our enemies, they want us to be last. You know what I'm talking about? That's why they try to beat us to the punch. You know what I'm talking about? If we have something going on for us, you know what I'm talking about? They try to devise plots and schemes. You know what I'm talking about? To try to get in front of us. You know what I'm talking about? So they can cut us off from the blessings that we 
our, to receive from God, our inheritance. You talking about, you know, but God don't like ugly. And he ain't too fond of pretty. You talking about these joints be thinking they, you know, they want to be idols. You talking about, that's why I always say, man, I, you know, I ain't famous. You talking about, I walk around here in the street with the people. You talking about, yes, Lord Jesus. He walks with me. You talking about, these joints be hiding off, got security and all that kind of, you know. Woo! I know they don't like me. You know what I'm talking about? I know that. But guess what? God loves me. He's keeping me here to steer his children back towards him, to go to his light, get up out that darkness. You know what I'm talking about? Get out that fight. Let him have it. Yes, Lord Jesus. Woo! Listen. It says, over here in 12. It says, again, he said to him, another servant, and they wounded him in the head and treated him shamefully. You know, they talk bad about Jesus. You talking about? They talk bad about him. You talking about? And as he made us in his image, as he claimed us as his children, you talking about? As he put us out the darkness, you talking about? We gonna be treated just like him. You talking about? That's why these people feel like I ain't gotta stop. I ain't gotta quit. You talking about even the dudes? You talking about? Yes, Lord Jesus. Ooh. Says, and he sent another, and him they killed, and so with many others, some they beat and some they killed. He had still one other, a beloved son. Finally, he sent him to them, saying, they will respect my son. He says, they will respect my son. They will respect my daughter. You know what I'm talking about? The Lord said, they, you know, they will respect us. But these joints feel like they ain't got to stop. They ain't got to quit. They ain't got to respect our boundaries. They ain't got to stop lying on us. They ain't got to stop trying to steal from us. They ain't got to stop trying to block us. They ain't got to stop trying to mock us. Ain't that all the things that they did to our father? He said some were beaten and some were killed. Come on. They trying to beat us down spiritually. But the Lord strengthens us. You come on. Yes, Lord. So we are never alone. Come on. Says. But those tenants said to one another. This is the heir. Come, let's kill him. You know. Our inheritance, these people will kill us for our own inheritance, for our inheritance. And when I mean our inheritance, it ain't got to be nothing material, nothing that you can see. It's just who you are. You know what I'm talking about? So they use their tongue as a sword to spread these lies, to spread these rumors, to spread this evil gossip. You know what I'm talking about? But his precious blood is a shield, you know what I'm talking about? And we plead it over us, you know what I'm talking about? We call forth the Lord to keep on moving forward, you know what I'm talking about? See, he is authentic or nothing. And you already know, before I go, baby, your babies, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I'm talking about, yes, Lord Jesus, we are a team. I'm talking about, he is rewarding us for our good deeds. Don't let nothing stop you. Don't let nothing 
Feel your joy. Yes, Lord Jesus. You're doing keep vibrating high. Yes, Lord. And I'm gonna holler at y'all joints later on. <laughs>